in Eevee, Bloom is the glow around bright parts of the render, and it disappeared from the render settings with the release of Blender 4.2. So here's how we add it now. Bloom is now done in the compositor, but we can still see Bloom in the 3D viewport without rendering because of real-time compositing. So first let's turn on real-time compositing. In either look dev or render preview mode, click this drop-down arrow, and at the bottom of the menu under compositor, change from disabled to always. Now go to the compositor, check the box use nodes. We get these two nodes by default. I'll also open a 3D viewport to look at while we work over here. And I'll have to turn on real-time compositing in this viewport as well. In between the render layers node and the compositor node, we add a glare node. Press shift A and search for glare, or find the glare node in the filter category. By default, the glare is set to streaks, which looks like this. But we now have five types of glare to choose from. And look at that, bloom is one of them. We can adjust the quality of the bloom, the mix of the bloom, the threshold, and the size. You could also try fog glow, which gives a slightly different look. And this is all visible in the real-time compositor and in the final render. If you want to get better at learning Blender, do these two things. Hit that subscribe button, thank you, and check out the Blender Secrets ebook linked to in the description.